Hi, I'm Rob Cooper, Product Specialist at ISO UK. And in today's video, I'm going to show you how to calibrate your ISO Color Edge monitor. Color Navigator 7 is our latest calibration software. Color Navigator 7 is ISO's new calibration software, designed for users of ISO Color Edge monitors. This is an upgrade from both Color Navigator 6 and Color Navigator NX. Color Navigator NX users will find this method of working familiar. If you are a Color Navigator 6 user, then your existing targets can be found here. If you wish to calibrate using these existing targets, click the preferred color mode. I'm going to be using the available calibration mode here. Then select your target to calibrate. However, for the purposes of this video and for new ISO users, please carry on watching to find out how to calibrate with Color Navigator 7. If you're a photographer, we would recommend to adjust your monitor to Adobe RGB. What you'll find is that this color mode is already available for you to calibrate right away. This is currently set to 120 candela by default. Many users find this too bright and may wish to change this. In order to do so, right click on Adobe RGB and select Edit Target. Within this drop down menu here, there are two different modes, Standard and Advanced. For most users, Standard mode will be adequate. In this section, there are many settings which you're able to change. However, the most common adjustment needed is brightness. This will depend on your working environment and for demonstration purposes, we're going to be adjusting the brightness down to 80 candela, which is a good place for you to start. Click OK to confirm. If your output is coming out too dark, it may mean that your monitor is too bright. You can now see that the adjustment is visible here and we are able to go ahead and click calibrate towards the bottom of the window. This will take a few minutes to complete and then you will return back to the main window of Color Navigator. Your monitor is now calibrated to Adobe RGB via Color Navigator 7. We hope this video has been of use.